Hello friends, welcome to Cool ID Help. This is AutoEd Basic Concept Tutorial Part 4. Here we will understand how to create the custom functions and how to call those functions in a script. Let's begin. Now first we will see how to create the functions without arguments. Syntax is very simple and the calling is the same as you have seen in the other programming languages. So first we will see the declaration of the functions. So guys, you need to use the keyword FUNC, then you have to give the name of your function with this curly braces. And after that, you can use the uh, statements that you want to call through this function. Uh, and at the end, you have to use this keyword end FUNC, then the proper closing will happen for your function. So the opening of the functions will start from FUNC. And the closing of the function will start from the end func. So this is the complete syntax for the function declaration and this is no parameter function. Okay, so we have no arguments here. And the way of calling is simple that uh, you need to just uh, use the uh, method name and simply call this way. And uh, we will understand the uh, use of uh, the arguments function how to use that argument based functions so here we will see the syntax as well our declaration will be same and if you need uh, the parameterized function then how you will declare those functions here so for f u n c then the name of your function and here in this curly braces you can use the variable so our variable is msg so this is not fixed you can use any type uh, you can use uh, your uh, uh, variable name i'm using my variable this way and i want to print this thing inside the message box here so i've just used the message box to show this passed value and this is the closing of the function that's it so this is parameterized function and uh, at the time of calling we need to pass the argument this is the calling of the function and uh, we are passing one argument inside this single quotes you can see here we have the single quotes so this is the uh, parameterized function now we will see a uh, function with more arguments so the same way we have declared the functions here and uh, we can declare and we can use more parameters func uh, function name braces first parameter second parameter and here we have our message box to print those parameters and here we are trying to concatenate and print the combined value on the message box and this is the closing of the function that's it this is very simple and here we have the calling of the function okay here we are calling that function this is calling of function so calling is simple uh, we need uh, two arguments because we have uh, specified two parameters so first one is the my static string and the second one is this way the name of file means uh, whatever we are passing we are using single quotes for that so this is the calling and let me show you uh, by running this so you will uh, get the clear understanding let me copy this first and going back here quickly uh, here in this uh, script editor and now let me remove this so this is function declaration it doesn't matter the order of a declaration or calling you can uh, remove this from this place and you can put it at the downside also you can save the script if you run this script this also works Let me run this. Okay, this message box function was called. So this is the message which we have just given here. Okay, and this uh, symbol is coming due to this value. This is the message box type 64, which will show the I means the information symbol here on the box. And this is the title which is coming from here. I have given here, that's why this is appearing at this place okay so you can call this this way as well uh, no matter 
order is not important and uh, let me run this let me show you for better understanding okay also working okay let me close this and uh, i'm going to run the second one with two parameters okay so message one message two and this is the combination of message one and message two so we will get the result concatenated result on the message box just saved it and going to run it through script runner select the script click open and we got the result okay so this is our message error unable to install file name of the file here we are getting the same combined message and guys this is the way to declare the function and call the functions i hope this concept is clear to you if you guys found this tutorial relevant and useful please hit the like button and and please subscribe to learn more and guys for now thanks for watching cool it help